very interesting and significant Bible code table for our time. Our time is just now we enter in the month of Nisan, the month of redemption, Messiah, Passover. Definitely we have to prepare ourselves, definitely. As everything great needs, requires preparation. So preparation or repentance, faith in God, whatever it is. So let us see it's in Hebrew, but as I said, <laughs> difficult to find time for translation. You, what you find different you have Google translation. So I will try to tell you exactly what it is here because it's so significant and important for our days. But the first thing which is in the center of this table is in black. Achana le Mashiach. Preparation for Messiah. No. You must have preparation if you want Messiah. You have to keep the Torah, the Shabbat. You cannot get Messiah if you don't keep Torah and so on. As my mother did say, Israel will not be redeemed unless they keep the Torah. So, what comes here? Only twice in the Torah preparation. I think this is the minimal one, whatever it is. So it comes exactly with the verse that we are going to read the Sabbath in synagogue. Achodesh Azelachem, this month, which is Nisan, to you, Rosh Chodashim is the beginning of the month, the first one. Rishon Lulachem Lechoshe Hashana. It is the first one for the whole month of the year. Amazing, the letter U of the year is sharing with preparation for Messiah. No. So this month, no doubt, supposed to be past preparation for Messiah. This is why we read this portion of the Torah, the additional one, yeah? About this month, about the preparation for this month. So, if you want Messiah, it's not enough to believe that he will come and so on. It's nice, but you have to keep the Torah mitzvot to get the vessel to obtain or absorb this light of Messiah, which are great on this month. What more we have? It's an amazing phenomenon, by the way, that you have minimal, since the first minimal, the second one, minimal. This month, about preparation to the month, to the Messiah, and this month, we're smitting the Torah, we said it's one of the conditions for good table. What more we have? Preparation. Which kind of preparation? We have three times the word repentance. In Hebrew, Teshuvah. Teshuvah in red. Teshuvah in purple from the top to the bottom. Parallel, very interesting, yeah. But it's parallel, beautiful. Then in gray, again Teshuvah. In gray, Teshuvah. Three times. No, in fact, very simple because there are three conditions for repentance. Once is to regret, harata, regret, when we realize what we did wrong, realize the damage that we caused to the world by sinning, we regret, sorry. Then comes the second one with the heart. Confession, I right? confess on what we did wrong, then come change of this, Shinema said, behave differently, according to the Torah. So maybe this is why there are three times Shuvayu, but repentance is important. What more is important for repentance for Messiah, besides repentance? Faith in God. Our Rebbe's gave us that in Egypt, because God believed in God, and faith in God, it was the very deep. And our Rebbe said that the same thing will be in future exile, when you are now in the exile of the Arabs and Edom, also. Faith in God. Come here, the word Emuna in black. Emuna. The Aleph is here. The Aleph is the, from the verse, Achodesh Adelachem. If you want to see this verse, you have, it is in uh, Exodus, I think, second chapter 12. Okay. What more we have in this table? You have Purim. The question about Purim already. We passed Purim, it was very nice, what, what this Purim is doing with Pesach 
Amazingly, the Talmud tells us in Sinus, so our text Sinus is in 29 page, that from the time when the month of Adar enters, we increase joy. Now we increase, but what is drinking more liquor, more whiskey? By understanding learning, the more you understand what is going on in the world, right? And you understand even why troubles are happening. No, then you are happy. There's a very famous verse which says that there is no greater happiness and joy as resolving doubt. And you are, no, this is what the Bible code shows us. Yeah, we understand what is going on. We understand when we translate the Torah to Abu. So, you know, everything comes here. So, from the month of Adar, and Rashi said also Nisan. It means that it's also the month of Nisan that you have increased rejoining, right? So, both of them connected. Why? So, our Rabbis tell us because Purim is hidden miracles. Why? Pesach. Month of Nisan is a revealed one. So basically, miracles happen already from Purim. So this is why happiness and joy connected. This is why you have in the table Purim and Pesach, which is the first of this month. And then you have, amazing, you have Esther three times. You have Esther in green. Yeah, Esther in green. You have Esther in red and Esther in yellow. Interesting. So Esther was this one who saved the Jewish people. She told with Mordechai to the Jewish people, if you don't repent, Holocaust will come. It is known that in first the Holocaust in Germany, it wasn't really to be in Purim. Only Jews at that time repented, so it was postponed or delayed to Germany. The ten Nazis, the ten Amman, children of Amman, you know, this was exactly, yeah, six million. If Jews would not listen to Mordechai and Esther, it will be exactly happening in Purim, because the man wanted, now Amman, he wants to do it, Amman wants to do it. It's amazing. What we have here? No, you do redemption, then you have son of Jesse, Irene, Vin, Ben Ishai, will Messiah, the Messiah of Ben Ishai, Leave another Messiah, Messiah of God, Messiah Hashem Elokecha, son of David, Messiah may be another one, like Cyrus. Cyrus, you can hear Cyrus, hear Chorus, why he was called, he was called really Messiah, Messiah of God, in chapter 45, book, as I can see, the first verse, I think, God says to Cyrus, my Messiah. Anybody who helped Israel, who believed in Israel, and doing everything to save Israel, like those Donald Trump, no doubt. The Kabbalist, the cook, or by cook, says that he has spark of Cyrus. I see clearly now that he understands exactly that Biden is a disaster to Israel, because once you give a Palestinian state to Palestinians, so the civil rule will be the Hamas. The Hamas was before also elected, yeah, not the PLO. Because all you see that all the Arabs really support Hamas. All the Arabs were so happy, yeah, you know, who, when they heard about what happened, the massacre that the Hamas did to Jews, you know, killing, raping, everything. So, you know, what they did, what the, what the Arabs did, who? <laughs> They were happy singing and, and giving a sweets, yeah, no, these are people who want to make, to make peace with. <laughs> frightening, frightening, all these verses here and the Torah tells us exactly. So how can you do? What, what the South Africa said, they are genocide, the Israelis, what they are genocide, what they are people, they are killing terrorists, terrorists will kill them. They also want to kill them. So this is genocide. We want to make genocide is the, the Hamas, because they say clearly they want to wipe out the radical Israel. This is all the people. But South Africa is the Iranian, whatever it is. So 
whitening. South Africa is such a nice country. I was there uh, for almost 15 years. Beautiful place, no doubt. Okay, but this is what is happening at such a crooked world, twisted. Okay, what more we have here? What more we have? Salvation. Teshua. Interesting with Esther. This was salvation. We sing in Puri, we sang Shua Tam Salanesa, salvation of Puri will be forever. This was he's supposed to have now. He have also Yeshua, Yeshua is the salvation also. So unbelievable table, really. Minimum the Torah preparation for Messiah. And which kind of preparation? Redemption, uh, repentance and faith in God. Then comes exactly what will happen. The son of Jesse, Messiah, salvation, unbelievable. So, have a good Shabbos, very important Shabbos, by the way. I said something very interesting that that is written in book that the Gematia of Shabbos 702 is 27 times God name, 26 times 27. 702 Shabbos. Why? Because the God of names, the names of the Hebrew letter are holy, and every letter really indicates a different way to the name of God, 26. So Shabbos is a day of holiness and sanctity, is as if. Now, the addition one month, Chodesh, we are in the Chodesh, is 312, which is 12 times God name. So together you have on this Shabbos 39 names of God. 39 come to the Kabbalah says that 39 Hebrew is Tal, view. View represent light, spiritual light. And this is what is going to shine on this Shabbos. Shabbat Achodesh, because it's very, very important Shabbos. And the lights which are shining on each other are great, but we need definitely the eyes to be able to see it. This is really difficult, but this Shabbos is very, very elevated and important Shabbos. So, let's say have a good Shabbos, an enlightened Shabbos, as we say, and hoping that this month will be, will be a, month, a month of redemption. The Gematria of Rachodesh Zelachem, the Gematria of this month to you, is Meshach ben David, son of David. So interesting and very significant. Table for all time.